Hey guys, this is Queen Deja, and in today's video, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm watching something. Today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode three of Girls Band Cries. Let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. It's a little too fast. Girl, it <laughs> in the picture. I mean, she was up all night. <laughs> Me last night, <laughs> literally going to bed. I went to bed like, well. I took a nap, a second nap within the day. <laughs> I slept around like 11 ish, woke up around like 2 ish, and then I stayed up for the like most of the hour of like night, and then I did not go to bed till 8 a.m. And then an hour later, I was up because my mom was going. <laughs> so don't do that. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Bobina, I mean, because you know, Oh my God, how can you be so sure about that though? Mm-hmm. <laughs> hmm? 
I mean, that just tells you how dedicated she is, though. <laughs> Nina. Well, yeah, you just need to multi balance. But no, honestly, Nina, it's your fault. You're the one who's focusing more time on music than your studies. All right, enjoy yourself. Yeah. You got this. You need to experience life and, you know, get out there. <laughs> no. Yeah, she got lost. Plus, these two need this moment. Nina still feels some type of way about Subaru. And I hate that. I mean, because Subaru's just trying to be nice. Yeah, she's a little overly nice, but she's just trying to be nice. Damn. Yeah, and if you don't want her, she is reading the room, so.
issues, right? Okay, do you want her to let you know when she's being friendly with you? I, I mean... You guys are causing a commotion. <laughs> oh, cool. Makes sense. <laughs> so it's okay. And Nina probably like, I don't know how to stop about this bitch. <laughs> no! <laughs> One second with that crime. <laughs> Well, yeah, Nina, are you going home again? Nina, get back here. You're gonna do fine. Not as good as you. Uh, Nina!
literally pour all of your fucking emotions into music. And still study at the same time, yes. Nice. Come on, Nina. Good. <laughs> mm hmm And don't worry, you just need some really good tea and some sleep. <laughs> Do y'all even have a name? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. It's okay.
come on. She looks so cute. <laughs> and, and you're just wearing it for this episode. After this, y'all literally get y'all style. <laughs> Yeah, almost like something that Gwen Stefani will wear, no doubt. That or really Katy Perry. Yeah, I can see more Katy Perry. Like OG, OG Katy Perry when she first started out. Yeah, definitely. Wasn't that? <laughs> and it's a drop, man. Oh. Subaru, what the fuck? Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Hold everything. Bitch, you just joined last week. We just got the first freaking performance of the three of them together. And now we're getting to next week. Oh, I'm not. I'm leaving. <laughs> you know, my grandma wants me to pursue acting full time. So, you know, I can't really do both. So, I have to choose. It's either the acting or the band. And I'm going to choose acting. Bitch. If it is you, because I know it ain't Momoka, and I know it ain't Nina. So who else is left? Mother effing Subaru. Girl, don't piss me off next week. Don't do it. Sit your ass in the side. Don't do it. I swear to God. But no, 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 no. Okay. Once again, I, I get the fact is, like, the tension between Subaru and Nina is fucking hilarious like baby is over here looking she side eyes her like any time that she can but the thing is and i'll say this um i i totally get it for nina i have had friends or i've been in moments where once again the shy girl in me um and the first impressions and stuff when someone is a little too overly cheerful, in my opinion, and it kind of gives you a little headache, you're like, damn, I really don't want to spend time with this person. But I think the more that you get to know someone and you learn their levels of ish, that's when you can be like, okay, I I'm cool with this. But um, I get the fact that she doesn't like someone who is quote unquote overly friendly. I think we've all dealt some dealt with someone, guy, girl, whoever, um, who is essentially overly friendly. And it's like, psh, 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 boundaries, bitch. Like, boundaries. But she's just trying, she's trying her hardest to be friends with Nina. And I hate the fact that Subaru is trying her hardest. It's like, damn, like, yeah, she's just a really sweet girl. And she just wants to be friends with her. But because of the fact is, Nina was bullied and such, I think she thinks that Subaru has this, like, mean girl complex in her. And, and who knows? We really don't know that much about Subaru and her past. Maybe next week we might get a little more context on her and such. Because 
that would be interesting. We just know she's like a really upbeat, cheerful girl who's kind of up for anything, and I'm all I'm here for it. Like yes, but still, there's something else there. What it is, I don't know. Maybe we'll find out, possibly. But no, the song was good. Um, I just hope, as a group, and, and we know we're going to see it eventually, with the, okay, like, somebody, we need to just talk about outfits and matching. I need you girls to take a, like, a look-see from all the girls from Bandari and D4DJ and how, you know, their outfits match. Because they fucking match. Especially my girls, Rosalia. Because, duh, they they hit every single freaking time. Rosalia has not had a bad outfit. Ever. Any other outfits freaking hit and such. If I could say one for maybe. I, okay. This is just, since some, okay. Here, we'll do it like this. Um, I'm a girl who, I'm okay with, like, swimsuit outfits and stuff. Sometimes, like, fan service is good. Sometimes fan service is not so good. I'm not saying that these girls need to do, like, swimsuits. Please don't. Um, especially because Nina is... Mm, Nina's not really underage. It's more Subaru. Subaru, I think, is the youngest out of her. I think so. Like, Subaru... Subaru and Nina, they, they're, like, kind of around the same age, right? So, no, I deadass would not want to see that. But, um... So, for Bandari, and because mo majority of the girls now are officially all in college, we're now seeing a lot more, um, or the return of fan service in Bandari. Because if you look at how it was the first year, uh, yeah, and, and but it's not, I'll, I'll say the fan service, in my opinion, for Bandari is not like Desate in a nutshell. Because Desate's, okay, Cinderella Girls fan service, it, it's there, and when it's there, it's just, you can't look away, it's just, right there but um Bandari's kind of getting in that moment and, and then d4 dj because majority of those girls are underage and then you have like three groups that are like adults and such i get it if they're just doing it specifically for the adult the adults but no they're doing it for the kids too but i'm like i have my established girls that i love mermaid duh rosalia duh yeah, 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 but no, no, no. Hopefully, we do not get like a be if we get a beach episode, I'll, I'll be okay with it. I just hope you know, no, no swimsuit performance, no, no, please don't. Give me some nice, wholesome ish. But yes, coordinate on the freaking outfits. <laughs> like it took me out for a moment, even though the outfit was cute for Nina. It, it took me out. We're like, girl, girl. It's supposed to be a rock concert. You're in a band, baby. This ain't pastel palettes, baby girl. But, okay. You do you, baby. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode three of Girls Band Cry. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my master squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all next Friday for episode four. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.